All right, we're back with some more Walking Dead, and it looks like uh, our little Russian friend over here is uh, limping, limping along. We got a baby on board. Is that it? Is that what? That's a transformer. Hey, Terminus. I'm talking to you. What? Are, are the cannibals here? It's, it's what? What do you mean what? The place you're fucking taking us. Arvo, that's not what you're taking us to, right? How much further is the house you were talking about? Answer her, god damn it! There's still more work. Some more hours. God damn it! I knew this was gonna happen. This guy fucked us. Uh, thank you. Don't mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. I, I don't think I want to imagine uh, that Arvo is fucking us. That would probably be some really bad, uh... Time. You don't fucking know that. I know we've been walking all day and we're still fucking nowhere. This isn't helping. We're all stressed. Let's just get a night's rest. Yeah. I'm gonna sleep real fucking easy tonight, knowing this asshole is playing us. Fuck. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. Agreed. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. Uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. All right, I guess I'll take the baby. I don't really fucking have any interest in doing that, but whatever. <laughs> Apparently that makes the baby happy. I didn't expect that to work. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. That's a good sign. Is it? Is it a good sign? Bonnie, you creepy asshole, get away from me. Here, I got him. That look was just the look of a pedophile. That was creepy. Come on over. It's safe. Is it? Is it really safe? I don't think I believe it. Alright, yep, check your six, Clem. It's always good good to do that. God only knows if he's got more Russian mafia friends. Today's my birthday. Really? Near as I can tell, at least. Well, happy birthday, Luke. <laughs> yeah, man. Happy birthday. How can you even tell? Been keeping track of the days. Been a few times I wasn't sure I'd see my next birthday. Well, you did it. Guess that's uh, worth celebrating. I guess it is. One, so one, uh, one more year in the zombie apocalypse. What? Twenty-seven. That's that's right. I'm surprised you remember. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. Feels like thirty. Sorry, Jesus Christ, that. superstar reference. Sure okay, uh, paperwork, waiting to collect. Probably. I'd have liked to go to college. I think a lot of people in this zombie apocalypse would have liked to. Hey, Kenny, just a waste of money. I would, I'd agree. Well, College is a waste of fucking money. Art history hasn't helped too much. <laughs> majored in like art history. In a coffee shop, pretty much. Majored working in a coffee shop. Oh, that was awesome. Keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. We're saving it for a special occasion, and all it being your birthday and all. Hey, give me some of that. I want some, uh... This is as good a time as any. Wine? I'd like a sip. I mean, after you, obviously. Really? No. Oh, what's a sip gonna hurt? You are not drinking. That is that. <laughs> Kenny, come on. Don't be a beach. You're a little guilty taking the first Whoa, uh... wait. You gotta make a toast. Was that not gonna really be your toast? Either. Saying they were gonna be guilty boy. taking it for your drink? It don't have to be fancy. A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> to the loved ones that we've lost along the way. And to the hope that we see them again. Someday. Yeah. Here, here. Kind of a shitty toast, but... Seems like it got under nice. Kenny's skin. Yeah? I didn't mean for it to rhyme. <laughs> well, I got didn't even watch. know it. I think oh. the fence has got us pretty secure. Come on, Kenny. At least have a drink. 
Nah, maybe later. All right, Kenny. Clem, let him go. I'm gonna post up over near the hole in the fence there. Holler if you need anything. You betcha. Thanks, Kenny. It was very soothing, but very depressing Fire's knowing what could Lay probably end up happening. If you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Yeah, I think it's because uh, I got under her skin. She actually somehow she likes people. At least just me. It's a good thing. You saved our ass. I know. I know. I just don't know what she's getting out of all this. She's getting protection of me. I'm, I'm assuming she's treating me like her well, sister that she lost. That puts her as okay in my book. Well, it ain't no secret how you feel about her. Oh, oh <laughs> that reference. That reference. It was stupid. I understand. Hey, someone's got to get their dick wet one, once in a while in the zombie once apocalypse. Get past all the dirt and guts. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes. <laughs> Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> oh, Holy shit. Got a little one around. Sorry. Forget I said anything. I know what you're talking what about. You guys are talking about. I certainly hope not. You're talking about kissing stuff. Lol. Uh, yeah. Yes. Yeah, that's it. That's exactly that, it. That is exactly it. Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now. <laughs> you shut <laughs> Oh my god. <sighs> <laughs> Maybe she came back for you. No, she did not come back for you. I don't know what to say to that. I doubt it. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Clem. <laughs> no, I, I don't mean it like It's okay, Luke. She's just not impressed. Apparently not. <laughs> come on, Clem. Luke's a regular Casanova. Hey, shut up. Don't be modest. Your moves are working on all the ladies. Oh what my fucking mean? god, this game. Worked on me. <laughs> I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry, it's the drink talking. It's the drink it's talking. Man's talk is a sober man's thought. Hey, well, Mike's. Mike's man, got it. So they can take that shit somewhere else. They can take that shit to the bank, actually. She ain't a man, but that's the same. <laughs> it fucking means the same man, thing. Go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's can you give me a drink before I do that? Like that? Oh, and here, maybe a swig of this will change the minds. Might be a good idea. But does that mean I get to have a bottle of rum, bottle of rum, bottle of rum? I want to, I want to drink it. Give me the fucking rum. Damn it! I guess I gotta go give it to freaking Jane. Dora the Explorer is too young to drink, apparently. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol. Oh yeah. I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. Will it work? That depends. What is it? It's rum? Probably. <laughs> I would have expected you to be more of a whiskey or tequila girl. I don't know. It, it might be awkward. I wasn't expecting to... You know. Why? Because you made it with Luke? What does that even mean? What's the it? You know. Yeah. Because I made it with Luke. It's not a big deal. Why does this feel like I'm signing a contract? Or something? <laughs> put your... Put, <laughs> sign on the dotted line. And uh, sign away your firstborn child. That's really good. Have you had any? You want a sip? It's okay. Sure, I'll take it. Sure. <laughs> Are you okay? Absolutely, <laughs> Kenny's pissed. I better take that back. <laughs> I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. It's you know, a zombie apocalypse. I'm probably not gonna live till my 21st birthday. So drink. it might be Spicy wisest to just to drink as much as I want. What was its name? Earthquake or something. Sweet liquor. Sounds like you were a bad kid. <laughs> I guess Sounds like it. 
And just based on her actions alone, you'd think that sugar crystals. And I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple sugar crystals. Meth. Got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. Meth. And it shattered into a thousand pieces all over the dining room. And I proceeded to eat what I thought was sugar candy. It was not sugar candy. It was meth. <laughs> yeah. That meth. The problem with glasses, it looks a lot like sugar crystals. That's never really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. <laughs> my sister found me drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie thought I was dying, so she called 911. They pumped my stomach. Got grounded for six months. That is an I interesting story. About that in a long time. Take your swig. I guess a deal's a deal. Here. That guy needs a drink more than any of us. Yep, I'm gonna give him the rest of the bottle. Might be might be wise. Time to not make it weird. Hey, we got Jane to come back into the group. That's good. Wanna sit here? No. Do I? That's I'm fine. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Wherever you like. <laughs> that awkward smile. I'm gonna go talk to Arvo, our Russian captive. Arvo might want a drink. He's been through hell. I'm, I'm sorry about your sister. Say something. Don't be just like. Can I? Fuck you, Arvo. I figured I'd maybe have somewhat of a conversation, or at least give you some fucking rum. Okay, rum. Here you go, Kenny. Have some rum. I guess Kenny doesn't want to have his rum. What if I take the baby? There, there, little guy. Shh. Shh, I got you. I got you. Hey. Oh, hey, Clem. I asked you not to drink. <laughs> Girl your age, it ain't right. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to disappoint you. You're not, hun. It's probably not my place to be telling you what to do. Well, it isn't my logic that chances are I'm not going to make it to legal drinking age anyway, so... Might be wise to indulge while I'm at it. Needed some air. Well, that's good. There's air everywhere. <laughs> I'm sorry for, for how I acted back there after Sarita was... I just, I, I couldn't handle it. I'm sorry. I mean, you did what you could. Mm, that's right, Kenny. You tried to help, and I blamed you for it. We don't have anything to apologize for. I know you didn't mean it. Thanks. I miss my boy. I miss him so much. I didn't raise him like I should have made mistakes. Oh, yeah, there was a lot of mistakes. Think of Herschel. Off on a boat somewhere or other. Yeah. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him. From my family. But I'd give anything for one more second with them. To play catch with Doug. To touch Conscious Face. Anything in the world. Okay, now it's starting to get into the pressing zone. Be different with him. He's going to get raised right. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. That's good. We need you, Kenny. You don't want me and you are really the only ones holding the fucking group together. That and Jane. No sense in both of us being over here. 
I can handle watch on my own. Okay. Well, I understand if you want to be alone for a while. I get that way too sometimes. Thanks, Clamp. Ugh. Are you gonna just keep trying to depress me or something with this game? Come on. Alright, I'm not quite sure how much room I have left on my computer, so I'm gonna call the episode here, actually. Let's take a look at this transformer. Anything here for us? <laughs> feels like forever since we had electricity. Well, it probably has been, uh, been forever since we had electricity. Anyway, uh, that's... I'm gonna pause it here. Anyway, have a good day. Thanks for calling.